today we're going to do a small unboxing from uh, one of my favorite stores. Uh, it's probably the my most favorite store, uh, Otter Valley Railroad. Uh, ordered a few things in to take care of some customers' projects, and uh, I was not expecting this parcel till Monday. Um, the parcel I was expecting today won't be here till Monday. Somehow this one passed it on its way here. Um, yeah, this one left Stony Creek eight hours after the other one and arrived here today. So, not sure how that works. Somehow in Sudbury, uh, the bigger parcel got left. So, Monday I hope. Anyway, let's get this on the road. I need a knife. Should be ready to do this stuff. Might help. Okay. Some of you may know, you can order your true color paint through Otter Valley. Uh, I needed some spe specific colors for a project for a track mobile I'm doing. Uh, the customer wants it done in BC Rail Green. Dark green and light green. So I got uh, the dark green, oops, light green, and some primer for that project. Uh, then I got some sulfur for some of my weathering projects and I picked up some THB cream. Uh, I have a couple THB engines I need a little touch up in that area when I do some detail work on it. Uh, some track nails for me because I like to nail down my turnouts. I don't glue them. Rail connectors and uh, whose project's this one for? This one's a replacement for Martin's. That one cost me. I uh, shorted out a decoder while doing an install that the customer had paid for, so I had to replace the decoder because it was my boo boo. Stupid. Stupid boo boo, but it was my boo boo. And that's just my receipt. But that's it. A decoder and some paint. And, uh, my parcel that's coming on Monday, hopefully, has my new uh, NCE, uh, what is that, the uh, SB5 booster? Yeah, the SB5 booster. Um, I have seen guys short them out bad on YouTube. Uh, BG Model Works actually melted the case on his and melted parts of his engine to the track. Uh, yet his booster still worked. Uh, I had one small short through a turnout and my booster quit. I believe it's the power supply. Uh, I haven't tracked it down 100% but I uh, plugged in another 12 volt, not quite powerful enough to run trains with, but it lit up. So we'll see. I'm going to try powering it up with the other power pack when it gets here and see if it works. Uh, if so, then I'll just get another power pack for it and probably resell the new one. Um, aside from that, another decoders and stuff, but I'll do an unboxing on that when it gets here. Uh, I'm going to have another order going in here shortly for some scenery stuff that I need and some wants and all that other good stuff. Uh, I'm probably going to do a video later or maybe I'll just throw it in now, but uh, well, I'll do it later because it's a big mess. But I did get my background painted pretty much all the way around.
touch base on it later in another video. But that took a little bit of time. So, yeah. Today's job, first job, will be cleaning up the uh, layout room. Uh, I had a bunch of unskill stuff and bins that I had to get ready. I sold all that stuff the other day. Uh, no more end scale for me. Uh, and all that money will go into my uh, HO fund. So anyway, that's about it for today. Uh, thank you all for watching. Please like, please subscribe. Uh, no, I don't have Patreon up yet. Uh, it won't until I'm actually doing videos showing you guys how to do something because I don't think I deserve anything for nothing. Um, probably don't deserve anything anyway. Anywho, that's about it. Have a great day. Uncle Roy signing off. Goodbye.